Let's go. That was dope. All right, guys, welcome back to another video. And in this one, you guys know what we have to do. It is time to freestyle with the brand new car in the crate. It is almost tradition at this point when a new crate comes out to take the beautiful new car that is in it and showcase it for you guys, customizing it, maybe a little bit of a review of how it handles, what hitbox it is, and then take it into some freestyles and just have a ton of fun with it. So that is exactly what we're going to be doing today. And it's going to be a ton of fun. So leave a like down below if you enjoy it. So smack that like button for some freestyle luck and without further ado let's jump into game here so i already ended up trading for it on pc it was only like four keys which i actually got for a good deal and i even got a gray one which is technically painted but i didn't really care i'll go down and find it here but i don't really think the samurai will be a card that i'll use in the long run just because it is the uh the breakout hitbox if you guys didn't know it's the breakout hitbox so i got my gray paragon one i'm excited to use it personally i love the look of it and let's actually make a brand new preset or mess around with this preset they actually patched the freaking trim the silver octane trim with the superman decal that's so dumb i have no idea why they did that but um nice job psionics <laughs> but here we have our samurai oh man it looks good with anodized i do want to do the this side real quick that looks so freaking dope actually you know what i'd be down for sticking with this customization so far the white wonderments the dark blue and then the white on the Stormwatch. and then what does it look like with slipstream not too good, and then Heat Wave always looks sick on it. So the other side, I have it like pure red. So we're definitely going to have to change that real quick. And actually, I want to do just the dark. And then I do want to do a light red, but uh, with Stormwatch. And then for the wheels, I do want to do the ones that we've been messing around with a little bit. The Diomedes. I think these look so good on the red side of a car. And then the boost. For the blue side, we'll have the classic white lightning. And then on the red side, how about some black ion? I think that looks pretty dope. So there we go. There is our car and we are ready to go. So let's take this into training real quick. I want to make sure the car itself actually feels good because I've also heard that like cars have been handling weird just ever since the update. So I don't know if that's true quite yet, but um, yeah, I don't really know quite yet. Might just have to play a few games. It does feel a little weird, but I don't know if that's just because I think it feels weird. So who knows? But uh, as for the car itself, I mean, it feels right. It feels like it turns fine. It does feel very wide. I don't know if that's just the breakout, but it feels like even wider than the breakout. Like, I compare the breakout kind of close to the Dominus, but I don't know about this. That was so weird. I don't know. Something maybe feels a little bit weird, and I don't know what exactly that is yet. I don't know if it's the car, if I'm just not used to it, or it is the... Or it is just the game itself feeling weird. But let's get into some freestyling. Gotta do some spinner roonies with this. So training will start out with a couple training freestyles and then get into 1v1. So just spin a Rooney, <laughs> put it in. I like the way it spins in the air because it is, it does feel like super flat. The front end feels like very precise. Like especially when you're hitting them straight up into the air, it seems like they go up really high. And I believe that is the breakout hitbox, but like for these, yeah, like just, it skies it even higher than the Dominus, which is, I don't know. I've never used the breakout that much, so I can't really say. Do something and then do something like that. Pretty good. I mean, it does look very good for you, Sang. I'll admit that. And also, I like how the bottom is really painted. Even though I have gray, you can still see how much of it is painted. That was a dope shot. But, um, how many more should we do? I do want to at least do one more uh, shot like this. Since we are doing 1v1, these are usually the shots we go for. Just hit it up to the ceiling, freestyle up there, come back down, and get a nice little touch on it. Looks so good. I love the ceiling shots. I'm trying to think of like ways to make this even more complicated because we've got the freestyle to the ceiling and then the upside down flick. That looks pretty dope. I wonder what else we could do. Actually, I have been trying one thing. So you go up to the ceiling and then you fall off and do like a 180 reverse, you know, whatever you want to call it on it. Looks super dope. Just fall off. 180 and then like backflip into it looks dope but let's get into online do some highlights and uh yeah it's gonna be awesome all right here we go car looks dope on this awesome stadium is it dfh <laughs> i always forget the names something like that i'm sure of it so let's get some freestyles and maybe a little bit of dribbling like this like come on come on under him You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh my gosh. I should have let it roll in. But that was... I'm sorry I have to rewatch that. That fake was insane. 
All right. <laughs> I like carried it. If I had more boost, that actually could have been cool. But um, I did not. Oh, frick. That was a good little carry and flick, but too high. <laughs> That's my new favorite thing. Go off the ceiling and save it. <laughs> Freestyle saves. Ah, too much. And it went in for some reason. Wanted to carry it and I touched it. <laughs> Oh my gosh, yeah, something feels really weird. I, I don't know, the car feels slow. Ah, close, should have gotten it a little bit higher. Oh, now we get to play as the red side. Oh, looks so good. I do love the look of this car. I'm not sure about the performance quite yet. Something about it still, now that I've played a couple of games does feel off it feels like heavy for some reason <laughs> I know a lot of other people have said that and I don't know if it's just like a placebo type effect but I don't know it feels odd like I just feel like I can't even get to the ceiling quick enough and it like messes me up I don't know we'll have to see you're annoying get out of here jeez <laughs> Just like right there with me. Doesn't want to go on defense, just wants to keep pushing at it. <laughs> nope. Get out of here. <laughs> this is so bad. I ran out of boost. <laughs> to catch up. Ran out of boost to catch up with it. And somehow it's. <laughs> Still faked him out. Amazing freestyle you have ever seen. And again, this thing loses 50-50s like no other car. Ooh. Not the strongest hit, but that was pretty dope. I'll take that. Let's watch that again real quick. Freestyle up to the ceiling, come back down for it. Would have loved a solid touch. Again, this car doesn't win 50-50s. <laughs> Feels like a paper airplane, but it hits 50-50s. Oh, get there. Like a brick. <laughs> that was interesting. Does that count as a freestyle? It was from my own corner. And I um, did whatever that was. I'll take it. You like that little freestyle trap? Just gently let it down. Hold on. Ooh, that was smooth. That little trap on the ground. Oh my goodness, Aquadome. Holy crap. I forgot about this map. I haven't played it in so long. It's literally been like... Oh my, how long has it been? <laughs> Tried to jump out of the way. Alright, well now I have a chance. And he still makes it back. This guy is not fun. Get out of here. No. <laughs> if I could have like touched it under him, but that freestyle would have been sick. That was a good dribble. <laughs> I'll take that back. Thank you very much. <laughs> Got him to jump. Faked him out a little bit. <laughs> Passed it like right back to me.
Let's go. That was dope. Finally a good one with this car. Just something's weird about it. I have a tough time like getting to the wall with it. I don't know if it's because it's like so short in front. I feel like I can't trap it quite as well or I'm used to the Dominus. But that was alright. I'll take that. Alright guys, on that note, that is going to be it for today's video. My final opinion of the Samurai, I like the way it looks, but do not like the way it plays. There's just, I don't know, there's something really weird about it. So I would really only say if you like the Breakout, then you might like it. But if you like other cars, then probably not so much. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe for more videos just like this in the near future. As well as check out some of my previous videos here, such as on the left. Going through every painted version of the new exotic wheels in the Triumph Crate. And then on the right, an awesome Triumph Crate opening. But other than that, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I'm the Llama Sir, and I will see you guys next time.